This playthrough is rated T for teen. You know what? I wonder if Elsa and the crew have been hanging around that, like, lake for, like, however many hours I was in Daryl's campaign, like, five hours or something like that. Greetings and salutations, viewers. Want to be back here with another episode of Front Mission 4. The last episode, Daryl and the crew were able to escape from, uh, from the, the governor's mansion about the loss of one of their own, and now they have to regroup and figure out what to do next now that, uh, Diaz isn't the biggest threat, but it's this, like, secret group that, uh, just has... You know, more men, more mechs, and everything with that. But uh, we'll let them deal with that. For now, let's head back to Europe and see how Elsa and the crew are doing. Back to the super creepy music. But yeah, I'd like to think that they've just been fl talking and sitting here for hours without doing anything. Remember how long technically Daryl's campaign lasts? I don't know. Like, I know we did like so many missions back to back and all that, like, however much time in game. But I'm talking about like story-wise like they've been just sitting here for a week just sitting here going i don't know guys but anyway let's get started i'm getting lots of that trying radio chatter can you tell us what they're saying latona they were talking about finding the criminals who blew up the tunnel we didn't blow up the tunnel they did criminals you mean they think we did it oh wait they are bad guys and they're probably trying to manipulate information and stuff like that and probably put blame on us most likely we were set up yet again there's no way we can safely go any further than zaftra a dot dot dot. Is, um, is then a safe way out of here? Obviously, we cannot go back through the tunnel. It is bound to be crawling with Zatran troops. Or zombies. I don't think Robert can make it out here without being detected either. We'll go to Nikolaev. Nikolaev? You mean the town near the Black Sea? But we don't have a ship. Well, I mean, we have floating Monzer, so. My uncle lives there. He doesn't own the ship, but he runs a trading company. He may be able to arrange something for us. Oh, main characters actually have family outside of the, or important people outside of the group, huh? There would be less Zaftran troops that way. All right, let us go to Nikolaev. Is that all right with you, Elsa? Wait, she's not the leader. I thought you were, dude. The, yes, that is cool. Ah, uh, okay, whatever. All right, anyway, before we uh, continue on, uh, no, we're not going to do simulation stuff right out of the gate. Although we will today, unfortunately. We're going to get quite a bit of story before we get to simulation, but uh, let's get to some... Uh, I need to look up my original build because now that I don't need the progress legs, at least for a little while, I need to, at least for this, so let me just switch everyone back to their original parts, so uh, let's see, I had you on a, t the Tatao legs uh, I had you on the Marriott Marriott, Marriott, Marriott legs or whatever so uh, legs, I had you on the Tatao as well Latona, I do want, or maybe I had you on the uh, Marade legs. Now I'm trying to remember. <laughs> hey, it's been like a week or whatever. Um, I think I gave you. Let's see, 22. Um, yeah, I think I gave you the Marriott legs, and then I gave you the because I wanted Bosch to be like really fast so yeah c48 we need to we need all the we need all the dodging we can get for our good old friend bosh here so um actually i think we could leave our armor types at a fire for the most part i was trying to think about one of the changes now that we've had some color changes go after a while i was wondering maybe we should change bosh up a bit just to yeah, give him something a little bit different Actually, we'll leave it all the same. Just change this color slightly, just to just to change up it. Yeah, let's leave it on fire. I think we'll do it for that. So, and that's pretty much all I had to do. Uh, we will do some pilot stuff later, but since I don't have access to the computer or shop here, no reason to continue on. So, we will have to make do with our current gear. See, he even says that right there. Had I known this would happen, I would have asked Allison to give us the latest British Army gear. Don't look at me like that. I wasn't being serious. <laughs> uh. We do not have much choice. Let us follow Latona's lead. <laughs> uh, Zed sometimes gets those comedic moments every once in a while. It's a little far to Nikolay, but uh, Zed said there shouldn't be too many Zaftran troops that way. And if you say so. No, I got just seeing you repeat. I would never have thought I would return to that city like this. Hmm? What do you mean, Latona? What does that downcast eyes mean? That eh, probably doesn't mean anything. No anime style longing or thinking of old old times or whatever. We should leave as soon as we are ready. We won't take long for them to track us here. I, I keep having issues with getting, like, Bosch's accent down, really. Just, I don't know. 
But anyway, let's continue. Let's move out. And then I'll look at my notes for my the next battle here while I do this, I'll do that. Yeah, instead of it being uh, Russia, it's now the Republic of Zaftra. <laughs> but yet Ukraine's still around. But anyway, I just find that funny in the context of the world anyway. So, man, it feels good to be back with people. Well, I mean, you have a group now, nah, whatever. I know what he means. So, where does this uncle of yours live? Don't move the harbor this way. What? Hey, can't we take a breather first? We are walking around big, huge mechs. Or we do we have our truck? I don't know if they, I don't think they have a. Tr well, I'm trying to remember how they travel around. Well, no, they had the plane as well, but they had to drop it off. But I wonder if they got. Ah, whatever. I'm I'm overthinking it. We can we can rest at Michael's. Just a bit more patience, homies. Oh, all right. Hey, wait for me. Nothing here has changed. It feels as if I never left. That's good, I think. Meh. You wish to live here, Vatona. No, but I came to visit my uncle many times when I was a child. Nikolai is a small city, but I liked it here. Uh, sometimes small cities are best. You know, a like small town America, to an extent, anyway. Uncle! Vatona, this is a surprise. What are you doing here? You should have called ahead. I would have prepared something. Uncle, listen to me. We need your help. Help? What do you mean? Who are these people with you? These are my co-workers. We are in the same squadron. And you are in some kind of trouble? Come, tell me what has happened to you. He almost kind of, his dialogue almost sounds like he does have the stereotypical, like, Russian-ish accent, even though we're in Ukraine. But I say, I see, I had heard that the troubles in the EC, but the Zavtran army? It must be hard for you, Latuna. I am sorry. I will be fine. You were strong ever since you were ch a child, or should I say you never let it show when you were hurt? I am sorry to interrupt, but there is any way you could arrange passage for us back to the EC, preferably by sea. Yes, I will help you. I will have my people bring your gear here later. Thank you, sir. But you will have to give me some time. Meanwhile, you can stay here and rest, or try to find something to do in the city as you like. I think I'll stay here. It seems I'm not getting any younger. I think Zed is supposed to be like... Either late 30s or early 40s, if I remember correctly, but, uh, I will stay here as well. If anyone wants to go in the city, I'll guide you. Yeah, let's, uh, hang out with, uh, Latona for a while. Why not? We don't, we don't know. Well, we didn't know much about her until she said she was from Zaftra, and then, whatever trouble you may be in, I'm glad to see you're doing well, Latona. Well, okay, repeat yourself. I can't believe I'm so tired. Perhaps this time I seriously consider retiring. No, we need your missiles. <laughs> no, no, not not in this. Or at least not yet, anyway. I'm so hungry I could eat a horse. I forgot I hadn't eaten anything since we got out of that tunnel. Eh, you'll be fine, Hermes. You're probably lean too, like most nerds. Nerd or well, never mind. Not most nerds. <laughs> most nerds don't usually know how to take care of themselves. So uh, we should let my uncle work things out for us. Let's just go into town. I know a good place to eat. Oh, you do, huh? I'd probably wouldn't, wouldn't like it just because I'm super picky. I know, I shouldn't be, but... It is a Vaughn trip from the tunnel to Nikolaev. The only thing I want to fight now is to slide down to sleep. <laughs> Blah! I'm a vampire! No. Alright, let's check out the town for a while, so... This is a nice place. It's very peaceful. Peaceful? You mean deserted? Many people left the city since I was last here. The Ukraine, Moldova, and Zaftran, these countries' economies have been on the decline for years. Kind of reminds me of uh, what happened during the Cold War and for a while afterwards. And still technically to this day, it's still... I mean, it's not the worst, but it definitely has some issues. I don't know everything that goes on in Europe, obviously, or that area, but I've heard it's... They haven't really had that economic boom again for a long time, so... At least in some countries, like I said. Um, uh, the Zaftran hit hard when it was lost its income from exports to the EC. But that doesn't mean Zaftra has the right to do what they want to, to do, what they did to the EC. Of course not. I do not need you to tell me that. <laughs> don't get a Russia, don't get a Zaftran lady angry, dude. Please stop it, you two. There is no sense in fighting amongst ourselves. We should fight the enemy, Zaftran. Yeah, you're right. I'm sorry. <laughs> dot, dot, dot. I think that's the most you'll ever get out of, like, a situation with this group. They never really come to blows. Actually, I don't think any group really comes to that. There might be a few heated discussions when it never gets that bad. Because that's not the plot. That That's not the story they're trying to tell. So It doesn't look like anyone's following us. 
I think we managed to lose the Zaptrinara way back in the woods. How do you lose big, huge mechs? That's what I want to know. Okay, anyway. I know a good place with a few blocks from here. I'll take you there. Let's see, okay. Let's go to Keel? Or Keel? I'll kill how ya, yar! My uncle used to bring me here when I was young. Here? To this place? A bar? Wow, he's a weirdo. I only drank juice, of course. My uncle's had many friends here. Yeah, bars have pretty much a lot of stuff in them. Well, it depends on the bar. Some of them will just have alcohol. Good bars will have like a bit of everything just to kind of cover that clientele, like the designated driver or stuff like that, so. Uh, hello. Hey, aren't you Sergei's niece, Latona? You can remember me? Uh, of course, Latona, of course. How is your uncle, Sergei? He's fine, but you have not seen him? Not lately, no. I guess he has been too busy to come here. Business is not as good as it used to be, you know. And I hear rumors that he's been dealing with shady individuals. Shady individuals? Ah, forget I said anything. Sergei's business is his own. And if you say so. Sergei's doing what he can for his people, you know? His people? <laughs> what do you mean, you people? No, be kind of Latona. Okay, just a second. Uh, I saw a ship from Asia at the docks earlier. It is not every day people from that part of the world visit the city. From which country you say? I do not know. Uh, let's see. Okay. Repeat. Boris. <laughs> I saw Sergei walk by earlier. He was talking with a strange Asian man. Well, I mean, this is uh, the world of after World War Three, so anyone can travel. Who knows? But it's kind of odd. What's, what's strange about him? Well, he kept looking around as if he was afraid of something. They looked like they were heading for Sergei's office. Nah, I changed his voice after halfway through. It is true that life here is hard, but many of us like the city and this country. I am one of them. I am the best at what I do. Okay. You repeat, you repeat, I think. Oh. Well, the city has not changed. Of course not. People have, have had enough free time and money to spend before anything can change. I just changed his voice completely. <laughs> uh, uh, Tolstaya? When I get the chance, I would like to go to another country and work there. Some of my friends are already doing that. But for some reason, they always come back when they have time. I guess you never forget your home, even if you are far away. Depends on the home you lived at, really, when you think about it. Uh, okay, just repeating. Alright, well, that was fun, I guess. Now we learned a little bit about the town and Latona, so... Let's go to the port and uh, see what's going on here. Look, it is Monsieur Suge. Monsieur Suge. <laughs> I almost forgot my French there for a second. Are you sure it's with my whale? What the? Chang? What are you doing here? You're supposed to be back... Oh, wait, no, you did run You did run off after what happened, but uh, I didn't know you went all the way to Europe. Wait, how long... I'm trying to think how long boat uh, trip-wise it takes from get to South America and Europe. I, I know it takes a while, depending on how fast this boat is, so... Of course, it is a very good condition. I brought it all the way here because I knew you was okay. You were the only one who could know its real value. Mm, all right, show it to me. This way, sir, this way. What was that all about? Maybe he was one of Monsieur Sergei's business partners? Dot, dot, dot. I'm going to see what they are doing. Huh? Wait, hey, wait, Latona! I guess something's wrong. We better go with her. Oh, but... <laughs> Come on, let's hurry before we lose her. Okay. Well, let's talk to Hermes. Come on, we're going to lose Latona. But what if we go back to Sergei's office? Let's see if they have extra dialogue. I think they do slightly. Sergey came by early. He said he might be uh, able to ex get us on a ship earlier than expected. Well, that's good. Come on, Elsa. We had to go to Latona. <laughs> He's like, get to the plot. What game? I, I swear there's a game I played a while back where when you like you had to do something in the game, but if you talked to everyone and ran around, they, all the dialogue was basically, hey, do the plot. Hey, the plot. And they kept having multiple versions of the line about basically go do the plot. A strange... Um, a strange Asian man. Yes, I saw him. He came here on the truck with something big loaded on the back. There was also a crate on the truck bed, if I'm not mistaken. It looked like the type of crate they used to store Vons gears. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Well, wait, wait, wait. Did he say something? Oh, okay. Zoge brought our trousers out of the woods using his trucks. It looked like he had done this kind of thing before. Never mind. Uh, maybe I'm uh, thinking about this too much. Hmm. Yeah, maybe Bosch. Maybe you are uh, thinking a little, a little too crazy there. Let's not, let's not get ahead of ourselves now, shall we? Okay, just uh, repeating himself. All right, let's go to the warehouse. 
Yeah, let's see what Chang is up to. I mean, they don't know who Chang is, but we know as the player. What so. is going on? What the voice acting? Randomly? Ha, huh, that doesn't mean it's an important uh, scene to occur. Shh, be quiet. Oh, sorry, game. I'll, I'll, I'll listen to your uh, advice. How long are you going to make me wait? Just a little bit more. Let's see. Ah, here it is. Hey, it's that monster he knocked out. Like, I guess he must have killed the pilot. Or the pilot died and he pulled his body out and just tossed it in the sea. I, I hate... You know, we never get that answer, by the way, so we don't know. We just know that he knocked the Vonzer out when he shot him with a rocket and then ran off. So he ran all the way to Europe after capturing this thing by complete accident, by the way. Exclamation point. Hmm. Never seen a Vonzer like this one. Which country is it from? Uh, the UCS, I think. You think? What do you mean, you think? Well, the menu is missing, so I can't be sure. But it has to be a new model. There shouldn't be that many of them on the market, so you should be able to get a very good price for it. Not if I don't know where it came from. Come on, it shouldn't be that hard for you to find a client. You have sold hundreds of these things over the years, right? Hundreds? Dun dun dun! This guy's a smuggler or gun runner or whatever you want to call it. Dun dun dun! Uncle, is this true? You're a gun runner? Wouldn't he technically be a Vonza runner? Yeah, whatever. Latona, this is none of your business. Yes, it is. What you're doing here is no different from what Zaftra is doing now. But I'm family, so it is different. You left this country years ago. How could you understand what goes on here? You already seen the economic not prosperity that's going on, so it kind of makes sense. I do understand. I know that this was the only way for you to take care of your people. And I know why Zaftra is doing all this. But I can't turn a blind eye to it. And who are you? Me? Nobody. I guess in the grand scheme of things of this game, that's kind of true. Where did you get this, Vanza? Ah, as I said, it's, uh, uh... This thing's Zaftran. It's the same type as the ones used in the EC attacks. Sorry if I cut his dialogue. I, I thought he was done talking. I, I don't know anything about that. I got this one in South America. That is strange, actually. What is Zaftran troops doing in South America? Hmm. South America? Uh-oh. What the? Zaftran troops? Nah, they must have followed us here. But how? I thought we hit ourselves pretty well. Army. How did they find us? Yeah, exactly, Elsa. How did they find us? Hey! You didn't turn this thing on, did you? Oh no, Chang, did you really? Huh? Yes, of course. When I brought it into the warehouse. You really don't know anything about these things, do you, Chang? Yeah, well you must have triggered its automatic homing signal. Aw, oh, dang it. I think she said that because of how loud the noise probably is, because they're probably not on their mechs, and they're hearing this loud blast of, like, bullets that probably are the size of car, well, not cars, but, like, half the size of a car. There's actually a game, um, I haven't played it in a while because, uh, I, well, it's because I found about it later on, but it shows, like, a scene of, like, shots being shot from a bonzer or something similar of that size, and, yeah, you can see the bullets, like, come down, and it just, they look huge, and, like, man, hopefully you're not a person right under that thing. What are you doing, Latona? Take your uncle outside! Wait, Mr. Sergei, where's our gear? T two blocks north of here, in Warehouse 7. Two blocks north, got it. I'll go ahead and ready the Vonzers. You guys go wake up the people in the office. What? Wait, the people in the office are asleep? What? But we need a ship to get out of here. We can take his. Oh yeah, Chang's. <laughs> huh? My ship? This is what you get for running away from Daryl in the group of the first part of the game. All right, be careful. I haven't let you down yet, have I? No, I guess not. Hermes is actually pretty reliable for the most part. And he's a great support char uh, support like character in battle, so... Elsa. Zed, Bosch, come on, we have to fight. I just got up! What is going on? How could we fight that they find us so fast? Oh, God, I keep changing Bosch's voice. We explain later, we must get to our monsters. Just because I'm not good with the German accent. Alright, that's cool. Uh, one of my favorite themes of the game. 
What took you so long, Elsa? If we don't hurry, they'll nail us before we even get our monsters. Uncle, will you take your people to the ship? What? You want us to go through them on our own? Don't worry, we'll keep them distracted long enough for you to reach the ship. Besides, once we engage them, you'll be the least of their worries. Yeah. Latuna. Go quickly. Hmm. But will we be able to fight out those troops and survive? Well, I don't know. We're not going to do that today. It's time to do simulation stuff. Yeah, I know. It's a bit disappointing, but uh, for those who want a bit of plot. But, uh, nope. I've got to got to prepare myself and set myself up for uh, for um, the battle later. So, okay. I'm just, I pulled up, pulling up my notes here for what I need to do. So, <laughs> yeah, sorry to, like, you know, they set us up for a battle. I'm like, all right, we're going to do it, right? And I'm like, nope, we're not going to do it today. So, nope. Sorry about that. All right, we're going to buy... <laughs> And of course, sadly, the music cuts off to the shop music, which I prefer the battle music. Not that I don't like the shop music, it's just, you know, I like the battle music better, so. Okay, we're buy, gonna buy skill slots for Hermes and Bosch. We don't need them immediately, but we're gonna have them ready to go whenever we whenever we truly need it. I already changed out my Vonzer parts, so I don't need to do that. Um, I don't need to buy anything yet. We will eventually, but that'll be a little while ahead, so. And I'm leaving all my mechs on fire, because I think in this simulation, the fire is more of an issue than uh than the pierce you can either do piercing or fire both would be solid um ways to do it if, uh, like either way but uh, okay elsa we want to buy you um we want to buy you ap charge too so we'll keep you up there um uh, skill slots plus four and link points uh for zed we want um uh, skill slots plus four we're not going to utilize it yet but we're just getting it kind of ready um and then Hermes, um, we'll buy the last skill slots plus two, and then we'll buy uh, a couple of uh, skill slots plus one. And then we'll go ahead and finally buy him. We're At this point, we're finally gonna need to have um, uh, Hermes with repair pluses at this point, so. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot to set. Let's see, I need to give, I'll give you a double shot and rapid fire. And then Zed, we're good on that. Um, Hermes, yeah, we'll give you Repair Plus 2. And then Atona, I don't think, I think I just need, yeah, AP for you. We'll save more stuff for you at a later date. Um, Bosch, let's see, we'll give you Skill Slots Plus 2. Um, I'll give you Move 1. For now, we'll save the rest of your stuff for later. Uh, like I said, if you have the points, you could give them like AP charge or anything. Well, that would also be um, solid uh, as well. Um, okay, let me see. I think I'm still. Yeah, I don't really need revenge or anything like that. Oh yeah, I need to set links for Latona. Or um, so we're gonna link Zed and Hermes mainly Zed, just so he's attached to um, attached to the group and everything. With like that, mainly we want Hermes as well. It's just ways to connect people together for purposes of EP and all this other stuff. Um, let's see. For Bosch, I think. Let's see. Yeah, we're good with you, Bosch. Uh, let's see. Actually, I think I could probably get you a couple of, uh, buy another um, skill slots, actually. Yeah, we'll do a couple of the ones just to kind of get them so we can equip a few more things. Okay, let's give you move plus one, and then, let's see, do I want faint, or do I want rapid fire? Well, I do have two abilities that unlock during during that, so probably faint's probably going to be better. Either one would be good. Uh, we'll do, uh, yeah, we'll do faint. I think it'll be appropriate here, and I think we're good on, uh, yeah, set fire to piercing, we did the linking stuff, so, okay, let's do the simulation. Yeah, I know, this is kind of a, almost a cocktease or whatever. <laughs> okay. Hey, you say we're back to we're back in Wasso, so uh, on this map. This one's gonna be not too difficult because of who we're fighting. It'll be a bit annoying, but nothing nothing we can't handle, so Okay. It's Elsa here. Bosh. Not that it really matters too much. It's just more as long as the characters are kind of roughly together, so
this will be easier than from like Daryl's story just because we're still kind of like we haven't hit that super powerful point in this game yet so okay this map is pretty straightforward and the great thing about this map is all the enemies come to you so uh, just over the course of the map they'll just all run towards us it can get we can get a bit boxed in though if you're not too careful so okay so we got a couple of uh um assaulters here they got two um type 67s on both both sides uh, they are linked to each other no skills but they are machine guns are plus two so they can do a decent amount of damage um uh even with uh even with the weapons that does i think they do like 13 14 damage or something like that that's why piercing could be solid here uh mainly because not because of them per se but uh because of uh the snipers we have here. We actually have quite a few snipers, and this one has a jetpack, so you can get onto buildings. Uh, that's probably, if you have to give a backpack to a character, probably give them your sniper a backpack is probably the best way to go, because just because it allows them to get to places easier, but uh, we're fine. Uh, okay, so anyway, he's got rifle plus two, so he'll do like, like 170, 180 damage, roughly. But we can't possibly dodge this, so that's why I was thinking maybe not piercing. Really, he's not doing fires, because we have quite a few uh, missilers around here. They don't do a ton of damage, so if you decide you want to do piercing instead, it'd be reasonable. But anyway, these two are uh, tied together. Uh, where's the other group? Oh yeah, there's a couple of sensor group units right here. And like all sensors, they have a ridiculous high evasion. Like I think at with their legs, I think it's like 30%, maybe less than that. So yeah, kind of annoying. Um, yeah, me and they weirdly are melee units. I don't understand that, but okay, whatever. Uh, they won't be a threat damage-wise. Um, like all sensor units, they're damaged. They're dangerous for their sensor backpacks uh, because of the missilers. But, uh, and then we got, uh, oh yeah, there's Hermes in there. And where's the other, oh yeah. Yeah, we got another sniper rifle. He's synced up to the guy right there. Um, so I don't think this one, does this one have the, okay, yeah, they all have jetpacks. But weirdly enough, the only one that really uses the jetpack is like this guy. I think it's this, yeah, this guy. Like, all the others, for whatever reason, don't use their jetpacks. I guess because it's not really necessary. And there's a, yeah, a couple of uh, uh, more assaulters right over here on the 67. Same thing, they're waiting to each other and do the damage they do. But roughly, for the most part, they're pretty straightforward. So, anyway, what we want to do is we want to basically get everyone kind of in this general area here, for the most part. We basically want to, I mean, the only reason we're not together is because there's really no good... Um, areas to get together. The reason we didn't do the drops here is I didn't want to be closer to the missile guys and I want everyone to kind of hit us about at the same time. And unfortunately I can't hit the sensors in the center there because all the buildings are there. So yeah, the first turn is basically just going to be us moving um, in the center here to uh, uh, converge with the other group. So. Alright, let's see what they do. Those guys, yeah, they're just got charges, and they don't have a lot of HP, so they'll go. They do have a decent evade, though. I think they get like 20% evade, so they can't possibly evade, but it's not as bad as sensors, that's for sure. Oh yeah, I think I forgot those uh, snipers there too, the uh, the ones in the woods. <laughs> it's because they're easy to hide in the woods. So, so there's one more set of um, missilers and uh, and. Uh, um, snipers. Yeah, there was like one like right here and everything, so. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's just move. Actually, do I want to just stick kind of around here? Yeah, let's move. We, uh, luckily, weirdly enough, the sensors move last on a turn, so. Um, so, like, if the missilers want to shoot us, they have to wait till next turn. Well, actually, except for here, uh, because I think they give like a, I think it's like up to here, so we'll put Elsa over here. Okay. And then, let's see, can I hit, see, can I get to use these over a little bit closer, just so we can get a missile into the sniper's face. Yeah, for this battle, we basically want to have Z kind of missling the crap out of uh, snipers. Oh, now he can't even move. Ha! Huh. We don't have to worry about him for a while now. We can just keep missing the crap out of him, so. Yeah, let's just. Uh, yeah, we'll just kind of. I guess we could just stay around here. Like I said, I'm just trying to pull everyone here, roughly, so we don't get. So we have ways to, like, avoid and move around and stuff like that, so. Right, come on out. Oh, 
Come on down. Yeah, I kind of got weirdly lucky with the... Uh, really? Aw, oh, man, come on. Well, he's not avoiding that. Ow! <laughs> Jeez. Well, next turn, he's not going to stay there, that's for sure. The only problem with, with tagging a sniper in the legs is that it's just like, well, he still has pretty good range, so... Yeah. Okay, now we'll be able to... Weird how he goes after the one lady who can actually physically fight. Well, actually, all of them could, but she's probably... Well, no, they got impact armor, so... Yeah, I was expecting them to probably avoid. Oh, well. Ooh, double strike. Two chances to hit his high evade. What'll happen? Let's find out. Ah! Both? Man. Yeah, I knew this was going to happen. Oh, well. That's sensors for you. Da-da-da-da-da-da. Okay, anyway. Um... I'm trying to think how I want to do this because depending on how I move, it'll be Z will be once again targeted by them, and he doesn't have the best evade, so. And he'll hit him if he moves, so I need to move at least a couple of bips. Let me. Uh, and I'm afraid, depending on how this works, I might not be able to hit him with a missile anyway, and this guy. Of course, I could. You guys are going to hit him on his next turn. This is a bit. It's a bit of a wacky situation. I feel like I'm gonna miss. Yeah, let's try it. He'll probably miss. Yeah, that's what I thought. Dang it. Oh well. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately that was a waste of turn with Zed, but uh, okay. We need. So you can hit. Whoops. So you can hit him there. You can hit him there. I need to move this guy just a little. I need. Basically, I need to move everyone down a little bit, just so he the the missilers can't hit, can't utilize his. Uh, I think it's four, so I, don't know, I need to I need to actually move everyone quite a bit, actually. So, well, at least if I'm remembering correctly, one, two, three, four. Yeah, so I have to move them all the way down here. Can you hit? You can hit where you're at. Bosch will probably have to. Uh, oh, wait, he does have that link ability, so I can afford to. I think I'll leave him here because, well, no, he can. Because I wanted to. Now I better use him just so Latona gets a chance to hit him, and then I can hit uh, go with Elsa after that. Nice, we actually, we actually didn't dodge. Oh, one of these has got to hit. Now one of them did. It's better than nothing. Okay, Latona. Yeah, we'll just move you all the way down here. I'm just thinking shotgun or... I'd rather shotgun just because it's two shots despite his resistance. So that's better than one. Now we're getting a little lucky. I guess I can't dodge all the time. I want to show up double shot with like this combo that I've got, but uh, I haven't gotten it to activate, unfortunately. But you can't, ow, you can't actually double shot with like a shotgun and machine gun. You don't have to have a machine gun in both arms. Man, I'm getting like really unlucky with this dodging. There we go. Ah. All right. Um, oh yeah, I forgot what Tona hasn't gone yet, so. Oh, come on. I was hoping to kill you guys before. Man. I was, well, the, the, the point was I could kill him before the Misslers could fight me, but I, I got just super unlucky, unfortunately. Uh, uh, yeah, I might as well kill Z. Yeah, I was supposed to kill that guy by this turn, so, whoops. Oh, well. I mean, that's just a missile. Uh, that's just uh, sensors for you. You just. They just dodge stuff. At least Bosch has like a. Was it a 40% to dodge or something like that? So he's just as good. I just feel like, though, the enemy tends to dodge better. Really? I was that close? Man, come on. Oh, well, at least Hermes can somewhat dodge. Oh, boy. Yeah, was, I might have to move back into the building. So. 
I probably should have done that. Oh, right, I forgot they're linked up to each other. <laughs> Whoops. Then again, like I said, this fight isn't super hard, just, um, yeah, this is where we want the fire resistance from. Now. Yeah, reduce that pain a little bit. Yeah, it hurt. It hurt. I, I... Yeah, keep attacking the melee character. I'm fine with that. Please hit him in the head. Or legs. That'll work, I guess. Man, my, my life for a... Uh, what's the word? For a... Uh, uh, grenade at this point. Uh, I kind of need to work. Zed's job really in this fight is to supposed to technically take out the Cypers. If you can help it. If not, then... Uh, then go after the, obviously go after the, um, let's see, I'm just trying to find, really, really I just don't want him, uh, well, he's going to get surrounded anyway, I could, there's a missile guy there, I'm just trying to figure out how to, like, move him, like I said, I could move him, hide him in the trees, Uh, yeah, let's maybe we'll get looking at him in the legs again. Yeah, but that's fine. Okay, Hermes, yeah, I need, definitely need to have you move somewhere else. Just not in the line of those guys anyway. How's everyone else's HP? Yeah, I think Hermes got hit the most, so. Yeah, let's go with the legs. Bosch, we'll have you move back here. What else? else uh, I might move here, here, and then Bosch have enough movement to go up, because I want to finish it. Well, oh, this guy's. Yeah, this guy's pretty much Dunyan rings at this point. Because I want to move Latona up a bit. Um. Latona up one so she can uh, um, hit the next group or next sensor. All right, ooh, piercing. If it actually hits, I was about to say I'll actually do a decent damage because it, you know he's got impact resistance. So uh. <laughs> there we go. Now you can't dodge anymore. Yeah, too bad to get all this Maya shot after the stuff. After the fact. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm trying to think, maybe move here. That'll give me one more. And because her legs are gone, I can just do that, so. Are we gonna kill you, or just like, you'll just maim you to death, you know? Hermes doesn't have enough movement. Ow, come on! <laughs> I was hoping to get rid of them so the missilers wouldn't be hitting me. Man. Why are you going... Okay. Unfortunately, Z can't really dodge that stuff because he's got like... I th actually, I think he's a mage of zero. Why are they going after him? Well, like I said, he's in the woods, so... He'll probably get hit with a couple stray bullets every once in a while, but... Oh, there you go. I was wondering when you going to start doing that. 22%, huh? I was about to say, you're going to hit me, aren't you? That's just how it works. And more missiles. That's fine. So we got the... We got the... Yeah, unfortunately, weirdly enough, these buildings aren't big enough to, like, not get hit by the missiles. you think it would be. Like, we are just, like, right behind them. Unfortunately, that would be just slightly taller. Unfortunately, even if the sensor sensor was dead, though, we, uh, the missiles would eventually be able to hit us pretty easily anyway, so. Okay. 
Let's see. Yeah, I don't want to waste his uh, missile on a. Um... Yeah, let's hit the. Let's hit this guy again. Ooh, perfect missiles. The perfect! There goes his legs. Now he's not really moving anywhere, so. Let's see. They're gonna get us on the next turn. You guys, you well, you guys are dead. So, but as soon as I move, he's gonna just start picking us off. I could move, try to move out of his range down here instead. Okay, so. to be careful about where I move here because we're now going to be at the mercy of this group. So if I move down this way. Let's see, Elsa can help, but no one else can. I move Hermes a bit or Bosch. Because I, you know, I obviously want them all. Although Bosch does have a good percentage to hit, so. Actually, you know, let's just go with uh, Latona first. Ooh, double strike, nice. Let's see if any of them hit. Oh, nice. These guys have a decent evade, but it's nowhere good as the sensors, that's for sure. Haha! Yeah, these guys aren't that difficult as long as they don't dodge, but. So they go down like a ton of bricks for the most part. Oh yeah, I gotta, I gotta have someone finish this guy off. Um, I guess I'll have it be Bosch. Nice. Okay, Hermes. Let's see who's. Yeah, we'll heal uh, Bosch's legs. Man, they just like going for the legs, don't they? I know I would too. Okay. Yep. Finish this guy off. I <laughs> didn't need that little extra hit, did we? I think t turn 12 is roughly when you want to beat this, so we're not doing too bad in turns. Uh, what's his resistance? Yeah, shotgun. Well, I think it has two shots anyway, so. Oh, right. Dodging. <laughs> well, you never know. This is why you want defense to activate on certain characters, so that way you can actually attack if they don't move. That's why I said Hermes to defense help. So. The only bad thing about this guy moving here is I basically have to move down in there just to mess with that guy because he, you know, Decided to be a little punk. Ah, great. Who are you going after, Elsa? Okay. Well, at least they're divvying up the damage a little bit. Yeah, now the sniper's gonna start. Why would you go after? Well, I guess it's because of that. Ow! Yeah, hurt me, Snowmuff. Okay! <laughs> And unfortunately, her, Z, the only problem with Zed's build I've got is he's got, he does have a low HP for what he is, so... I might just move everyone down here and tackle these guys, so... Let's see. Could hit him. Really, the, my idea is to, to... Because of how dangerous the... Oh, but I moved pretty far away. Let me... Heal in with Hermes before I have a move back. Because if he loses his arm, he loses, you know, all that, the those shots. So. Since uh, the snipers and missiles are the biggest threats, you know, I'd rather start weakening them out of all the characters. So. Yeah, let's get Latona. Good, doing good. Oh, there was his arm. Now he's pretty much worthless. 
Oh! Oh, this should finish him off for sure. And... One less... Oh, right, I forgot he's linked, but it's like... What, what's the point, missile guy? What, what, are, what are you trying to accomplish, dude? <laughs> uh, I don't think that's enough, really. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that guy. Um, let's see. So else really can't do much. I'm trying to think, would he even be able to hit if I... 57. He still hit him pretty good at 99. Um, but would he be able to hit if I put Elsa here? Too bad I can't do like a, like a, like a maybe scenario where I set someone there and then hopefully they, they counter, but I can't really, I can't really do that ahead of time. So I just have to, I mean, I could shoot with them. I just want to activate combos just for the purposes of, you know, <sighs> yeah, it's a really poor to hit, but I'd rather. I'd rather, guarantee, I'd rather guarantee someone to do extra hitting, you know, so. Oh, here we go. Yeah, you can actually do... <laughs> yeah, it's so cool when you get double shot with it, because it, like, ah, Bosch couldn't do it for some reason. Wait, why couldn't he? I don't know. Uh, maybe it's, maybe even though it said 99%, but maybe that was from a, um, if he attacked standpoint. So, yeah, there's little things I, I always tend to forget every once in a while, so. But, yeah, if you double shot with the, uh, with the machine gun and a shotgun combo, it just goes, you know. Uh, oh well. Yeah, they're kind of getting in on us, but the thing is, these guys aren't really that dangerous in the grand scheme of things, so them, like, converging on us is not that dangerous. It's the snipers and the missiles. You really have a bug up your butt for Z, don't you? He's, like, running right up on him to do that, too. I'm gonna have to start missling him. Just a just to stop with that. Yeah. Nope. I didn't even see his percentage of hits. So must not have been great because else was able to dodge it. So. Yep, you're coming up slowly. Good thing these guys don't design their uh, snipers to have uh, good legs. They skipped leg day. so you know. I was about to say, are you going to keep firing on Zed? Yeah, I'm going to need to heal her legs this turn. Okay, Hermie, or Zed, you are going to missile the crap out of this guy because he is bugging me. He is totally steaming on my vibe, dude. Oh, I could have missed. Yeah, whatever. Ooh, perfect misses. Ah! Now you can't go after me. That's what you get. You get what you deserve! Um, let's see. Just trying to figure out if I want to just... Have a, I mean, these guys are going to move up on me anyway, so let me go ahead and get um, the Tona over here. Just start wailing on this guy. Since you guys can't dodge for crap. You know. Oh, you shot me with some shotguns that, because your shotgun... Actually, what is your shotgun damage point? It's zero, so you do like no damage to me. Uh, yeah, let's repair your legs. And get Bosch in there. Uh, yeah, we'll have a. Well, they also start the chain. Yeah, I'll do shotgun because. Double strike. Man, you got double strike activate all the time. That's probably one of your best, uh, best abilities, obviously, but. Just because it gives you two shots with a melee weapon, you know? Oh, double shot again. Nice. I just love the brat, you know, ability that, that happens when you do that. This should... Oh, he didn't have enough AP. Oh, no! We almost finished it, but he can't really move that far, so... <laughs> it's like, what is he going to do? Hey, yeah, you're, you're shaping up really well, also. Getting the same... Not quite the same as Vado's Bosch, but pretty good. Oh, well. Can't dodge them all. I 
so I'm not really worried about his damage, so that's why I'm not too surprised. I can't believe I like leg hit all the all the snipers, just not on purpose either. It's just like, oh, it just happened to happen. Oh, but you can't even use your missiles because I'm don't. I think I think it is in the missiles missiler's AI that like if I don't know if every single missile AI has this, but I think a lot of them do tend to. Um, oh, and she didn't have enough movement. I was hoping maybe I could get like right in between those guys. I wonder if I de if I defeated that guy, maybe I can do that. But anyway, let's finish off. Yeah, let's go ahead and have uh, Z finish this guy off. I know it's a bit overkill for him, but. I'd rather, you know, do that instead. And then, let's see, Bosch can hit. If I can move. Yeah, I'll leave him there. Latona might even. Oh, I was about to say, he goes. Yeah, never mind, he goes first. I was about to say, maybe Latona fish him off, but I'm like, oh, right, Bosch's speed is naturally, without giving him any bonuses, is higher than, uh, than her. So. Let's do this one just because everyone will have a better shot here. So. Uh, I hate you guys. This is what missiles are for, is for you get people like you. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's see. Yeah, Z can help it or not Z um, you can help with that, so. Probably just him. Oh no, Elsa took a few good shots. Yeah, let's go with the shotgun even though it's lower to hit. Just because he's got, you know, pierce. Oh yeah, I got a blast, so now he can't dodge. <laughs> There we go. Now he won't freaking dodge now. What are you doing? <laughs> that surprised me because I'm like, why did you do that? I guess he has a thing for, for Zed. Uh, we will have to take out this sniper goes eventually. Oh yeah, I forgot about you. The guy like moves so slow. That's what time at. Ugh. Long episode. Even though the fight itself isn't that long, it's just a lot of story went into it, which I'd prefer the... I do like the story, so it's just, you know. I will have to get Z to... Uh, the only way really to hit that guy, I guarantee it, because of the building size. Because uh, it's... This one's a little bit longer, so I'd have to like move like way over here to hit him. I think he'll eventually move around, so I'm going to have him... Um, missile the uh, sniper. Really, that Zed's. Like I said, Zed's main job is to get these guys because of just the damage they do and everything. Um, yeah, you can't dodge anymore. Um, could have a could have a move in there and try to melee him. I'm just trying to think how I want to. Or have her go out and start set the melee that guy. Let's have Bosch. Yeah, that's a bit. He should be able to, even with his resistance, he should be able to finish him off. Yeah. You have somebody like this guy. Oh, I was about to say maybe she'll get lucky and just straight up murder him. Murder death kill. Um let's see. Um I'm just trying to think of who I want to heal. Who got hit last time? Was it Elsa? Good deal, uh that'll move him up there, and I'll have Elsa. Uh, does she even have enough movement? Oh, and she'll be line of fire for the snipers, though. Yeah, I'm just trying to think. Yeah, 
you moved in a very precarious situation. I guess I could start hitting the missile, even though I don't really want to. But you, what is your... I mean, we'll still get hit by... Yeah, um... Actually, maybe we should have healed Hermes. Nah. Ooh, double shot again. Nice. Oh, it didn't do. It didn't do the. Bruh. Man, Hermes shot does so much damage when it does it. Because I mean, not just because it's part of a combo, but just because it's breaking every single like resistance he's got. Did a decent damage. Oh no, shotgun! Oh no. I think shotguns are good, but they're definitely be they seem to get better late game. It just seems like just because you've pumped enough abilities and you've got enough points into it by that point. But early game shotguns are kind of hard to defend. Most people tend to like go machine guns for most of the game, even when they're fighting against a machine gun. Class. Really? Huh? Okay. I thought I thought those trees uh, had a pretty low to hit, but I don't know maybe. I guess Hermes makes sense. He's not gonna be dodging that. Not, not well if he can. Ugh, almost one shot him. Oh no! That sucks. Yeah, see, this is why you want Z to take out the the uh, sniper guys. They're very dangerous. I'm just getting lucky. I'm just getting a bit unlucky with that damage. That's why I was I was strongly considering piercing too because of just because of that. Yeah, let's finish these guys off. Or try. So close. Yeah, we better get rid of him just because of how much damage they do. Uh, oh, he shot he shot off his attack arm, so he can't even he can't even counter anyway, even if I wanted to. So. Yeah, the problem with Hermes is he's only got one one attack arm, so you kind of have to, like, make some decisions when it comes to that. I think I, you know, I think I'm going to have Bosch just, like, charge on in, because he's got a pretty good dodge, and I want him to finish this guy off anyway, so. I want to see you finish off the other sniper guy. Let's finish off this jack and ape. So body shots are usually high priority when it comes to like enemy. Um, could uh, she's got pretty good defense too, so or it could have him. Um, actually, can can she? Male? I forgot. Sometimes with certain, yeah, well, sometimes with certain areas because of the way the slant works, like they won't be able to jump or hit. So okay, that's fine. We'll just have her uh, attack you. move it anywhere. But for a missile, that's not that big of a deal. And I think Bosch and Latona have pretty good HP, so they can survive a, uh, um, let's see. Yeah, we want a shotgun with you. Uh oh. I, I did choose a shotgun arm, right? Yeah. Okay, good. For a second, I was like, uh-oh, she lost her, uh, arm. She won't be able to count. And you're done, son. The sniper should have too much of a target with those guys to really worry. Latona's got plenty of HP, so. And high evade. Yeah. I knew she was gonna get attacked, but. Yeah, luckily, with our fire resistance. There we go. Okay. Where's the other. Oh, yeah. Elsa killed her. So. Or him. What? Well, actually, they're just robots, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> hmm. Probably just skip everyone and just go after him, really. Just because of. Uh... Just because of him being the biggest threat. So. I don't think anyone's gonna. Mm. Yeah, we'll have you. Yeah, Latona. That way she can. Um. Counter, if they attack the missile, I can have a sheep counter with them, so. Ow. 
I guess you can't, it's hard to dodge at point blank range. At point blank range! Ooh, double shot, yes. I love, I oh, don't know, I just love double shot just because of how it looks. You know, what it does and everything, so. Actually, what's Hermes? Yeah, Hermes should be close enough as long as I move a decent space with Elsa. I'll shotgun him. Everyone should combo on this guy, so he might have finished the turn. Very nice. Actually, I, I was I forgot to check uh, turn count, so I forgot what turn we were on. Whoops. Oh, well, I can look it up later, I guess. All right, let's look at our uh, stats here. Let me look at my notes. All right. Um, so 2,300 credits, which is what we got, and 10 average. And yeah, Bosch got a little under. Boo. Although I think I got him a bit of extra in one battle, if I recall, so that might not be too bad. Yeah, this one isn't really about gaining a ton of EP, just because of what's going on here, so. I think, I'll have to look, I think I was at turn 13 or something like that, so I went a little over again, but. Yeah, we got, we got a few issues at the end where we get blown to arms and limbs blown up, but overall, not too bad, so, but looks like we're a bit better prepared, but will we be prepared enough to see what's outside and uh, get to our ship in time? Find out next time in the next episode of Front Mission 4. Thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time.